I am Om Prakash Bhardwaj. I welcome you all to this video training session of Start Pro, which is a 3D structural analysis and design software. We look into different sides of the design and analysis which we use to apply in our engineering domain that is in our structural engineering problem that may be building, that may be roads, that may be commercial apartments, that may be residential building, that may be bridges and that may be literally anything. And if we have a broad perspective of the uses in different structural farms and engineering universities, you can find very clear picture about the choice of use of Start Pro. Out of 50, 47 leading farms, they are using Start Pro. And out of 10 universities, 7 are using this particular software. We'll understand the different conventional approach for solving structural problem and also the modern engineering approach. If you see these two different sides, manually we do the design that maybe the foundation or the pile or maybe slab, column and other structural approach and do the definition about the mixing that is the RCG and we formulate and we integrate with respect to our knowledge and domain protocol. But if you see the modern approach, we do the computer added designing approach where we prepare the layout and there we prepare the elevation and plans and after that based on the size and requirement we do the basic development of the structure piles where we'll procure it and we integrate with the suppliers then we implement all the aspect of structural analysis and during analysis we validate and we produce a economic design that is through structural design that may be slab, column, structure and all the parts of your design and finally we define the aggregate for your concrete and the standards which will follow and during this process of structural analysis we take care everything about the standard codes for RCC as well as steel and also the earthquake standards which we use in India and in different countries. The fundamental difference between the hand calculations and by using computer that we have to understand very very well. If you see the statical determinant structure and indeterminate structure through hand calculations by governing equations you can find the unknowns. But if you see the computer the robust problems can be managed and we can integrate this problem solutions to your practical problem and we can avoid the time factor and we can produce the desired output with economic consideration. But if you see the breakthrough which structural analysis through FEM finite element method is come across is something element. Fundamentally what finite element approach does is whatever the structure you have that may be a bridge structure that may be your monuments that may be any structure we use different characteristics of element and we divide the 3D model into some sub domains or you can say we discretize this or you mesh it or you divide it into some sub elements then you can find out the results over the each node which is basically this corners and this item is known as element with different configuration and shape based on the requirement for complex object we may be approaching through the higher element or maybe for simple object you may be approaching a simple element that in our independent sessions we we'll look into this and if you see the exact solution which you can achieve the red line which is shown here and your finite element solutions which can directly get close to your exact solution based on the this below shown element scenario. For example, if you have a cylindrical object and you will mesh it, maybe you will go for four elements, one, two, three, four. So you cannot capture the curvature. If you increase the element, 
to 16 number and you will be getting more closure to this you can see this red shown here closure to this line and still if you keep on increasing maybe 30 to 64 120 or maybe 200 you will get very very close with probably 0 percent error as that of your exact solution which we are looking for so this is the technology which you use in your finite element analysis approach which STARD is using and if you see different structure this is the physical model and this is the structural analysis model where we divide the foundation and the structures into small small elements and you can find out the stress plot strain plot and stress may be because of shear failure because of bending because of twisting or maybe axial or maybe because of any sorts of failure in the strain energy that we can find out through this particular methods and we can directly produce a economic design and you can get the solutions quickly without waiting for the approvals because the design and analysis both are integrated to each other in our coming video lecture session I will broadly explain you about the structural analysis program start pro in depth thank you